Tesla Kijou on this one. We need some, we need some talk back, uh, certified tech roofing, talk back. Hello, hello. Yeah, we're, uh, we're gonna possess, uh, Royal Mountain Police. Uh, are you a police? All right, can you put me through to uh, a Royal Canadian Mounted Police officer by the name of Dave? Pardon? Can you put me through um, to a Royal Mounted Police officer by the name of Dave? Do you got a Dave on your list? There's a lot of noise behind you. Huh? There's a lot of noise going on around you. I can barely hear you. Yeah, it's a CB radio. Um, can you put me through to a uh, RCMP officer by the name of Dave? Do you got a Dave on your list? I mean, there's probably a bunch of Daves that work here. All right, give me the third one down. I, I can't just do that, sir. Oh, well, we're having a problem here, boss. What's the problem? All right, uh, you want to put me through to the one that's uh, at the bottom? Uh, possessing an officer. Pardon? We're gonna possess an officer. You're gonna possess an officer? Yeah, it's in the oath. It's in the oath. What do you mean that you wanna possess an officer? In the oath of secrecy for an RCM police officer, it says, Do you solemnly swear that you will keep absolutely secret all knowledge and information of which you may become possessed? through your position Therefore, with the RCMP, you. that you will, without, not without due authority, in that behalf, discuss with members of the force or any other person, either by word or by letter, any matter which may, be, may come to your notice through your employment with the RCMP, so help you God. Okay, Oath of secrecy. So that's like initiated by royalty or something, and I am not authorized to talk to you, and you're having trouble transferring me to Dave. What's the problem? To Dave, 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 I'm not authorized to say his last name. He's on your list. All right, do you got 472? Do you got 472, Officer 472? That's not a badge number, sir. Okay, what do you got? You want to email me a list? I'll pick one. All right, the order is email me a list of officers with that department at certifiedtechroofing.com. Actually, we have another part of the oath of office for an RCMP officer, so you do need to email us that list. No, we don't email lists of Well, maybe you don't follow your oaths, but it's in the oath. Yeah, uh, read the oath. Okay, there's the oath of office. Do you solemnly swear that you will faithfully, diligently, and impartially, impartially execute and perform in the duties required of you as a member of the RCMP? Okay. Pause. Uh, yeah. Your duties are to process information. Go again. And will well and truly obey and perform all lawful orders and okay. instructions. Pause. Yeah. No, no, no. Just, just your, me, your, your office. Your office. Just your office. Yep. Okay, well, according to this number, you are on the address. Uh, the one in, <coughs> in Toronto. Yeah. We had a number we called because so we want to get in touch with the RCMP. So, okay, all right. So, the office that I called originally, what was the number? What was the I don't number? Know, but they must be closed because right now you've reached Ottawa. <laughs> Okay, okay so, so give us an RCMP officer to possess. So if we go to that office and there's officers there, you would be lying to us. No, I'm saying that the ones who would be there to answer the phone are there. If someone's working in their office, their phone line. Well, why don't you just transfer us to that office? Because we were under the impression that we're at that office. You're deflecting. You're not. You're deflecting. How am I deflecting? I'm telling you, I'm looking at Ottawa. Or, or, or they're deflecting, or somebody's deflecting. We called a Toronto number. Can you put us through to one of the guys in their office then, who's there? I promise you, you're getting put to Ottawa right now. 
So can you just put I us... I promise you, we called a fucking local GTA number. All right, we're having difficulties on orders, that's why. I promise you, I called a local number. I promise to God. Well, can All you right. find us... I'll direct us back over there, thank you. Direct us to an officer that's active over there. In Toronto. What number did you call? That's... Direct us to an office. We called the... RCMP in Toronto. Here, we'll go live on CBN. Okay? We gotta go live on CB. Okay. Alright, so... Sir, can you give me the number you want to be redirected to or at least the office? Well, we thought we were. We, go, uh, we were given a number online I'm about to go live and no one was there or something happened and now we're talking to you <laughs> just hold up we just got to put it through a CB radio uh, thing just hold on the line yeah hold on the line hold on the line uh, certified tech roofing certified tech roofing we are not allowed to possess an RCMP officer we are not allowed we called the local officer yeah, uh, the local uh, RCMP office. Apparently, they're closed and they transfer to Ottawa. I repeat, they transfer to Ottawa. When we order them to transfer us to an active officer there, they refuse to comply. We cannot possess. We need a little assistance. Trucker on rest. They just fucking hung up. They hung up? Yep. I don't like trucker on rest. <laughs> I need a little update on that. She got a little bit snitty on that fucking call and she hung up. Certified tech roof and we're on a fucking pro. And we're gonna call all. But we need your a little bit of assistance so the payphone is fucking resistant. I know they're a fucking rare device, but you know, you can find them and be some vice or some ice or fucking nice. I don't know. It's kind of risky. They got cameras on those payphones, you know. So make sure you wear a hoodie and look like a crackhead. And wear a mask and some sunglasses, too. Don't look like a trucker, bro. Start to think smart. Authentic fucking zoomeries. Go something. fucking operative style, and, bro. Uh, watch the Certified Tech website. It's actually uh, it's funny videos and crazy videos and fucking evidence. But it's also training on how to deal with these fucks. Certified tech roofing. Where's the fucking dog? <laughs> Give a dog a bone, bro. You know, we're in the fucking hell zone. It's going down. Alright, next door should be in office. Alright. Fucking hypnotist, bro. The psycho hypnotist. We're certified tech roofing, and we've been hypnotized, you know. We're gonna go fucking certified, bro. Like fucking acting like fucking chickens, I guess. Fucking flapping our wings or something. I don't know. Come down and check the technology. Holy fuck, man. I don't know. But they got the whole fucking community hypnotized to break that hypnotism. Um, like they're, they're hypnotists, uh, fucking psycho serial, serial killers, and they fucking have a big group. But uh, to break that hypnotism, they got to view uh, certifiedtagroofing.com. It does a great, excellent job of breaking the hypnotism that they have on the fucking whole population. Certified tech, fucking uh, certified ballsy fucking motherfuckers. Thank you for calling the Royal Canadian Mountain Police Central and Cape Sudden Province, Ontario. If this is an emergency, please hang up and dial 911. Please note that we have a cooperation with the Central and Cape Sudden Province. Thank you. 
Yeah, it is a lot of hard work. I'm gonna do it for free. Thirty free. Certified Tech Roofing It is fucking hell, and we do it for free. It's for the thirty free. Correction, correction. We pay a shit ton of money. <laughs> <laughs> you know, they think they can fuck with a billionaire that fucking mows his own grass. <laughs> but you know what? We're gonna get the ball fucking on criminal task. <coughs> We're still on hold? The CB radio is a lot more efficient than this shit! I guess we're just going to have to wire up all the certified trucks with CB radios and get on the road and actually start investigating some real criminal shit. Because <coughs> it doesn't look like any work gets done around here with these fucking criminals. <coughs> Where are we at? Hi, uh, well, this must be Ottawa. Yes, you've reached the Ottawa. How may I help you? How's it going? Um, we called, uh, the local detachment here in the GTA. Okay. Can you tell me why we were transferred during active production because hour? the office closed and now it's been retransferred to Ottawa. So we're taking everything here in Ottawa. Okay, when, when did they initiate this policy? Oh great, I'm glad we confirmed that it's not a policy, so it's obviously redirecting. Thanks buddy. Uh, major, 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 crime, major crime, major crime investigation. Major crimes unit, undercover. Call sign, fuckhead number one. Are you aware of it? No sir, Okay, um, what we need to do is we need to possess an RCMP officer. Do you have one in mind? What do you mean by possess an RCMP officer? It's an oath. Do you mind reading a oath? Are you an officer? It's it's to do with the it's to, when we're talking about possession. We're talking about. It says okay, here, and you, you can be a well-trained individual to deflect and uh, get off topic. Uh, so we'll just read you the oath. You can look it up if you want. The oath yeah. of secrecy for an RCMP officer. All RCMP officers do you solemnly swear that you will keep absolutely secret all knowledge and information of which you may become possessed through your position with the RCMP. That you will not without due authority in that behalf discuss with any members of the force or any other person, either by word or by letter, any matter which may come to your notice through your employment with the RCMP, so help you God. Now, um... Basically, uh, are you preventing us from prevent, pr possess, what's the fuck possessing the possessing officer. the RCMP officer? Are you preventing that? Are you um, stopping that process? No. Okay, great. Then give us an officer and put us through immediately. Sir, are you still there? Uh, I can understand your psychology techniques, but you just answered the question. You just answered a question. Now you need to act upon that and transfer us through. Uh, hold up, hold up, hold up. We got another one for another, you. We got another one. Hold up. For you. Oh, wait, wait, turn. She hung up. So she was, uh, 
uh, interfering with an investigation, I guess. Okay. You know, we can't really fucking deal with these guys because they're really fucking good with the psychology words. Holy fucking shit, certified tech, we just called the next fucking RCMP uh, fuckhead fucking office detachment and uh, we were transferred to Ottawa, uh, weird, we actually uh, asked them and uh, they said yes, and then uh, we uh, read them the oath uh, of possession and uh, they wanted to know what the fucking shit was, uh, but you know, I'm not authorized to tell, I'm only authorized to possess an officer. But she refused to put us through to an officer, and she refused to go through the old work of her office, where she has to do that fucking shit. And we told her it was a major crimes uh, unit investigation, uh, yeah, undercover. And we gave her a call sign, and she refused to fucking deploy. I think this fucking hypnotherapist is really fucking active in the community of fucking policing. I think he's done a lot of hypnotherapy. A lot. He's like a fucking uh, hypno, hip, hip, hypnotist, uh, hypno fucking, he's like a hypno fucking psycho fucking uh, serial, serial killer. killer, major crimes uh, activity. And he's actually hypnotized the entire fucking unit. <laughs> So uh, we're going to try to get through, but we might need some trucker assistance. We might need to fucking possess an RCMP officer. We got a lot of honk support, honk support, honk support, honky tonky, fucking ready go out, ready go out, honky tonky fucking rock. What's on my mind is the mandates. How you guys fucking responded to that shit. Okay, let me tell you about that shit. You know when you go duck hunting and you put that little fucking plastic duck out in the duck's land? Yeah, it, it makes some fucking land, you know? It's called a ploy. Yeah, it's a simple technology, right? A ploy. Okay. So, uh, we got better fucking ploy than mandate fucking technology. Check out, check out, check out, check out, check out, check out certified techroofing.com. And, uh, let me tell you the secret about the fucking vaccine mandates. The government has high cost files. Let's just go into one sector. One sector, one sector, sector, one sector, <laughs> one, I'll repeat, sector, one sector, sector of elderly people. Elderly people have a high cost file with the government and uh, the old age homes need to fucking mix medications and uh, do a little bit of serial killing. Uh, killing your grandmas and grandpas uh, in the old age home, especially if they're in the government old age home. And uh, they need a little ploy, a little ploy, that little duck, plastic duck, plastic duck, that little rubby ducky, that little rubber ducky, the, the ducky lucky ducky. They need a lucky ducky toy uh, so they can mix their fucking medications and cause uh, influenced fucking serial killing. And uh, they play with their little rubber ducky and they rub it real nice and uh, the rubber ducky uh, is a ploy. What the rubber ducky is, uh, COVID. COVID, COVID, number one nine, COVID. Or uh, some kind of <laughs> sadistic fucking plan to uh, make a lot of money at the cost of our uh, grandparents, I guess. You know, get rid of all that cost. Get gut rid of all that cost. And the pensions too. They'll get your fucking pensions. They'll get everything if you don't fucking do something. Yeah, let's uh, gut the cost, that's what they fucking say, let's gut the cost and write COVID on every piece of paper, eh? Uh, Mr. Campbells, why don't you tell them the orders of your orderly service at the fucking newspaper, fucking, uh, what do you call that? Fucking newspaper, fucking, uh, what do you call that? Newspaper, newspaper, newspaper. old folks <coughs> home, the government one. Why don't you tell them what you had to do in the old folks home? Certified tech. 
This is Certified Tech Roofing Break Break. This is Certified Tech Roofing. This is Colonel Collins Poppins uh, coming in live. Uh, yeah, live, live. Uh, lots of ones were alive in the beginning of the COVID uh, strive uh, to take down those files. So as a medical orderly, uh, they had me lock them away in their rooms like an SS officer. And no one cared to see what happened behind closed doors. And then the body bags started to pile up. Uh, and uh, we uh, didn't fucking think that was right, so we went out to take it to fight. <laughs> Estimated revenue off this operation by the government is fucking 17 point trillion dollars. 17 point trillion dollars. That's 17 point trillion dollars. And they're gonna use all that money to fuck everybody up because they're SS op. <coughs> Top. Corruption. Fucking the hypnotist serial killer. The psycho fucking serial killer. The hypnotist. He's got his little fucking little hypno fucking therapy, and it fucking works. It's like went into all the fucking shit. We can't even get proper procedure and process fucking done. It's like simple fucking paperwork. We got a paperwork king here. He's a fucking officer, and that's what he did back in the day. He's like the best fucking paperwork in fucking Australia. He won the medals and the rewards for fucking paperwork on the ship. <laughs> it's uh, fuck, he never even got to dip that much, but you know, after this, he's gonna be ballsy and he's gonna dip every fucking beautiful lady around because he's an officer, a military one. Hon, 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 uh huh, 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 uh huh. This is certified, I'll repeat, this is certified tech. I'll repeat, this is certified tech roofing. I'll repeat, this is certified tech roofing dot. I'll repeat, this is certified tech roofing dot com. I'll repeat, Canada's Wonderland. Head on down and we're gonna hit the town with the fucking reports. But we ain't gonna get nowhere, but they might fucking fuck us over for the coffee and tell us it's illegal or the food too. You know, they might tell us fucking repairing our truck on the highway is fucking dude, you know, and uh, rude, and uh, don't toot your fucking horn because Mr. Justin True likes that. Let me tell you a little bit of story about him. <laughs> uh, I'll get back to that. Let's have some jab back. <laughs> They're stunned, bro. <laughs> what did he say? They gotta get by me first, 410. <laughs> <laughs> like he said, I'll be there giving him money, no doubt. <laughs> need a big prize pot for their investigation lot, you know, it might take a huge fucking prize, like a whole fucking truck full of chains and bills just to get them to investigate these kind of thrills. But you know what, we might need a convoy of fucking money with the pellets fucking honey, we need the community fucking funny. They need to get a bit fucking lupo and crazy old and fucking go certified with us. Slam down the hammer. I'm the judge of judges, you see. I judge judges. I'm bona fide and originified. I'm hellified and I'm honored by God. You know, they got the king of kings and the lord of lords or something. You know, that's an old technology, but the judge of judges is kind of a new sound and it's unclaimed to ground, so I'll take that fucking pound. And that's my order. Hey, uh, uh-huh, 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 let's get a honky-tonk fucking roll. Well, actually, 
keep it top secret for now. Let him take the first action of fucking heavy response and then fucking roll town. Get the duck convoy fucking round. <laughs> Where the fuck is CRT? We're breaking all the rules. I don't know, bro. Where are the police when you need them? Certified's gonna have to take this show. It's the horse sound, the horse round, the horse lock down. We're gonna do a horse lock down, lock down, lock down, lock down. We're gonna lock down the horses, you see? The horses, we're gonna lock them down. That's the $50 bill all around. We're gonna lock the horses down. We're gonna lock the horses down. I repeat, lock the horses down. Possess, possess, possess. Read the oath. That's the $50 bill, that's the $50 bill, we're gonna lock the horses down, we're gonna set them down and lock them down, we're gonna fucking lock the horses down, I repeat, right around the $50 bill, the $50 bill, the old one, you know, the round one, uh, we're gonna lock them fucking horses down, you know, we're gonna bring them down to town and we're gonna lock the fucking horses down, possess them, and they're not allowed to talk to other officers according to the fucking oath, they have to go with you, you're under your possession, go get me the fucking town and bring them down and tell them that they don't, how you don't have the fucking uh, evidence and uh, you know, it's a very serious fucking crime, is, uh, but you don't have the fucking evidence and just bring them down to Weston and Rutherford. We need uh, the entire Canadian RCMP force uh, and uh, then i will proceed in uh, secondary possession and uh, we'll fucking lay a bunch of red devils out there and uh, troll the fucking town and we'll catch every one of these fucking psycho fucking psycho killers that have the hypnotist fucking training and we'll fucking really re-fucking overhaul it's a re-overhaul, I repeat, it's a re-overhaul, we're gonna re-overhaul, overhaul, overhaul, we're gonna re-overhaul, we're gonna stop this recycling business. The recycling business is conducted by the police, and they like to recycle everything. Uh, drugs, they like to take the drugs and recycle it. Uh, they sell it, and then they fucking seize it, and then they sell it again, and then they seize it, and then they sell it again, and then they seize it. They recycle it. It's like selling a fucking $20,000 bill for, like, fucking $100,000, fucking, like, 500 fucking times. <laughs> it's a very lucrative industry of recycling drugs, but we're gonna fucking put a stop to this. This is the watch certified tech roof and and uh yeah we ain't afraid does it sound like we're afraid let's go dance Seamus. Same oh, idea, yeah. Seamus. <laughs> let's go don't dance you love going to hell don't you love going to hell oh don't yeah you love going to hell and say it like that oh yeah oh yeah i love going down to hell and finding all the swell and putting them all on notice with the bell uh-huh. Mr. Campbell's. Uh-huh. 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 Uh-huh.